Cece Loves Science, Push and Pull by Kimberly Darting, Shirley R. Johans, and Vashi Harrison. Cece and her friend Isaac walked to school. Cece pulled her dog Einstein in a wagon. Isaac kicked his soccer ball. Today was a special day. Miss Curry met them by the flagpole. Is Einstein ready for science class? Miss Curry asked. Einstein hopped out of the wagon and barked, Woof! Einstein is excited, said Cece. Cece was excited too. Cece loved science. She could not wait to get started on a new experiment. Today we will learn about Push and pull, said Mrs. Curry. These are the forces that move objects in different directions. Can anyone think of an example? Cece raised her hand. It's like when I pull Einstein in my wagon, she said. Isaac raised his hand. And when I kick my soccer ball, he said, Exactly, said Mrs. Curry. Now let's do our lab and see how these forces work. Your mission is to make a treat dispenser for our special guest Einstein, said Mrs. Curry. Woof, barked Einstein. Team one. Cece. Isaac, Sam, and Emily were on team one. Daisy, Caroline, Jacob, and Zara were on team two. Team two. Miss Curry gave each team the same materials. You need to use all of these items to solve the problem, she said. Each team had scissors, a ruler, tape, a pencil, a cardboard box, cardboard tubes, and a paper cup. They also had a toy dump truck, a marble, a string, dominoes, and some doggy treats. Cece, Isaac, Sam, and Emily studied the, the materials. What should we do first, said Isaac. I know, said Cece. We can build a ramp for the truck. Yes, said Emily, and the truck can haul the marble up the ramp. This is going to be fun, said Sam. Woof, barked Einstein. Sam measured the cardboard box. He cut it into three flat pieces, one rectangle and two triangles. Emily taped the pieces together. Cece put the marble in the truck and pushed the truck up the ramp. When you push something, you're applying force to it, Mrs. Curry said. Is this experiment your push is the force moving the truck up the ramp? Einstein 
put his paws on the counter. He pushed the hamster cage with his nose. The hamster jumped off his wheel, landed on his ball, and rolled. His food bowl tipped over. Splat! Einstein wagged his tail. Cece pulled him away from the counter. Einstein, Gus doesn't want to play with you, she said. What's next? asked Emily. We can build a tunnel for the marble, said Cece. Emily and Sam taped the tubes together to make a tunnel. Cece flicked the marble out of the truck. It rolled down the ramp and into the tunnel. The team watched the marble roll out on the other side. Excellent, Miss Curry said. Einstein jumped up and put his paws on the counter again. He pressed his nose against the fish tank. The tank slid across the counter. Water swooshed out. Splash! Einstein said, Cece, sit. Maybe we can put a treat in the cup, said Emily. So when we push the cup over, the treat falls out, said Isaac. That will make him happy, said Sam. How do we use the dominoes, asked Emily. I think the marble will push over the dominoes, said Cece. If it rolls fast enough, the dominoes will push over the cup, said Sam. The team lined everything up. Let's try it, said Cece. Woof, barked Einstein. Emily rolled the marble into the first domino. The first domino hit the second domino and pushed it over. The second domino pushed the third domino over. When the last domino toppled, it hit the cup and the cup tipped over. The treat fell. Einstein gobbled it up. It worked, Isaac said. Oh no, said Cece. What? asked Emily. We forgot to use the string, Cece said. Sam shrugged. Any ideas, he said. Cece picked up a piece of string. I wonder if it's strong enough to pull the truck, she said. Let's test it, said Emily. She grabbed the other end of the string and pulled. Cece fell to the floor. Einstein licked her face. Cece giggled. I guess pulling can be a strong super strong force. Her team laughed. We can tie the string to the truck, said Emily, and pull the truck up the ramp. The team set up the experiment again. Cece pulled the truck up the ramp. Sam pushed the marble out of the truck. The marble rolled through the tunnel. It pushed over the first domino, the last domino, and push the cup, push over the cup. The tree flew out of the cup. This time, Einstein caught the treat and gobbled it up. We did it, said Cece. Good job, everyone, said Mrs. Curry when both teams had presented their push and pull treat dispensers. Woof, barked Einstein. I guess Einstein loves science too, said Isaac. And treats, said Cece, hugging Einstein. Cece loved science, but she loved Einstein most of all.